for joining me for another video this is Arlene Stings please don't forget to like subscribe and comment on the link below if you're new to my channel thank you so much for joining me and welcome you to my channel today what we're having we're having Wendy's 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 um, I'm having I haven't had this in a long time every time I party with my son I used to always send him to Wendy's because we'll be hangover he will always give me my chili um, chili bowl this is um Delicious. Anyways, this chili is like a little chili bowl with cheese and also my packed bacon, bacon potatoes. So I'm having this today. I um, hope you guys are having a great day. Also, my ice water. My wife is not joining me today, but she'll be joining me later on for another mukbang. So I'm going to do because it's early and I haven't eaten since yesterday. I also got some crackers. For my chili bowl. Oh, this is so, so good. I don't know if you guys ever had it. It comes with cheese. So I'm gonna start, be I'm gonna begin because I'm starving. I'm hoping you guys having a great, great, great day today. Um, last week, we had such a great time with my friend. Mmm, with some salt. Now we're going back today. Yes, we're going back to see my friend. I haven't seen her like before in like eight or nine months, and now we're seeing her back to back. Mm. Mm. That's so good, guys. I don't know if we ever had it. But this is a loaded potato with cheese. I'm going to put a little bit of hot sauce. Even though this has hot sauce. I'm gonna, let me try this first. Look at that, guys. I don't know if you all. Chili ball. Mmm. 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 Is this neat? There's some crackers. Miss Sugar, thank you so much for your shout out. And congratulations on your 200, um, 200 subscribers. You deserve it, girl. Anyways, thank you so much. And that was a big, huge ice cream. I don't know how you finish it. And it's funny how you were trying to put those, make those popos go in the video they didn't want to go into. In the video, that was funny. So anyways, congratulations, Miss Sugar, and your 200 subscribers. I want to be like you when I grow up, Miss Sugar. So there you go. Okay. I'll be throwing a pate at 200 subscribers whenever I reach 200 subscribers. But I do appreciate my new subscribers. Thank you guys so much. So now they have the crackers. Mmm, I haven't had this in such a long time. This is delicious. All oh, those beans, that cheese. Look at that cheese, look. Mmm, mmm, mmm. I don't know why it's been such a long time since I had this because it's really, really, really good. It's the best. To me, it was other than Thai food and menudo. To me, it's one of the best hangover food. But if you guys ever had Thai food, that was really because all the spices and the heat and all that. Mmm, it's like the best for hangover. Mmm. I'm not having my egg this morning. No, I'm not. Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. The dogs are going to be happy. Mm -mm -mm. Yum, yum, yum. Anyways, guys, so let's dig in. This is so good. My wife likes the one with chives, potato with chives, I'm sorry, cream and all that, but I can't have it. This cheese I can have, no problem. But sour cream, for some reason, any kind of white cheese, I get really sick. And this is goat cheese. If it's goat cheese, I can have what I want. 
And I love sour cream. This is so good, guys. Going back to my chili bowl. My chili bowl with crackers and cheese and everything else and beans. This is really, really good. This is not expensive at all. If you buy both of them together, just this and that, it's like six, seven bucks. For loaded with protein, deliciousness flavor, and the loaded baked potato, this is all you need. You know, I never used to say the potato skin to I met my wife. She always eats the potato skins. Now I do it. Before I used to always, I didn't think you're supposed to eat it. We never eat it. And that was growing up. But now, yum, yum. Mm -hmm. This is so freaking good. Mm. Hope everybody had a nice Friday. We did. We stayed up a little bit, even though my wife had to work today. Mm. Mm. Oh my God, this is so good, guys. Mm. Anyways, even though my wife had to work today, she stayed up with me. You know. I love my wife, she, even though we get on each other's nerves and all that, nobody has ever taken care of me the way she does. She takes care of me. Sometimes it gets on my nerves because I know she was the best for me and I'm like, no, let me hurt myself. Let me smoke. Let me do this. Let me do that. But I do appreciate her because she's, other than my mom and my brother, my older brother. She's the only one that's ever taking care of me, only wants the best. So even though I do argue with her sometimes because I know she wants my best and I'm like, I'm not ready to quit smoking. I'm not ready, um, you know, not to eat cheese and I'm not ready for this or that. I love her more because even though she knows probably an argument is going to start, she still does. So, anyways. I love her love for me, so. Okay, so I'm getting mushy because I'm gonna start crying, so. I'm gonna start eating more chili. So anyways, I'm blessed, guys. If you guys ever find anybody that you love, it has to be mutual, okay? The love has to be mutual. And I'm talking right now to men and women. If you love somebody, you guys have to be back. And they want nothing but the best for you, no matter what. And they're down, like they call die. What's it called? That thing that I say, die hard, whatever. Don't mess up, because it's very rare to find somebody that truly loves you for who you are, one hundred percent. And when they love you that way, and they're down for you, and they'll do anything for you. Don't mess it up. It's actually so many people, it's like they want it. And as soon as they have it, it's like they're afraid to be happy. They're afraid to have the ever happy because I've seen them, you know, suffering, you know, alone. Wanting a relationship. And then they get it. And then they get somebody who totally adores them and boom, they mess it. It's like they're afraid for success. So... If that happens to you, you're lucky if it happens once in your life. So I'm telling you guys, if you ever find anybody that is truly good to you, don't mess it up. Don't be self-destructive. I used to be self-destructive when I was young, younger. So dumb, you know? So anyways, this is my advice to you guys. You know, I found this woman 13 years ago. I'm never going to let her go. As long as she loves me, I'm always going to love her. I'm not going to mess it up. So... 
That's my advice for the day. I'm sorry, guys. I got a little deep. Deep, deep. Look at that. Look, 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 look at that. Mmm. So delicious. Mmm. So I got my wife. She's working today, but I got my wife some garden salad. And she goes, can you give me some of your chili? That way it feels more meaty. So she got some. Mm -hmm. You know, and that Wendy's not too far from my house. I just forget to go there sometimes. I don't know when I have, I love the food so much. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to start going there more often now. The one my son used to go about 14 years ago, that one closed, but they opened another one closed in my house. But I was so upset when they closed that one. No. <laughs> Those were the crazy days. I never had crazy days, so I got older. All through high school, part of college. I was never crazy. I was always into sports. I got crazy after 35. Isn't that weird? I did not get a bath. Well, no. I did about 12, 13, 14 years of craziness. I'm so glad I did because now I'm not interested whatsoever. I'm not interested in being reckless anymore. I'm not interested of um, just being crazy. You know, sometimes I think you have to get it out of your system. A lot of people I knew got out of the system when they were young. I couldn't. I couldn't do nothing when I was young because I had to take care of my mom. So I had to be strong. And be there for my mom. So, my mom passed away of now was 34. At 35, I went crazy. But I'm glad I kind of did. You know, I'm glad that I'm healthy and that nothing serious happened to me. A couple of crashes, but that's about it. But I'm glad um, that I'm inside of my system because now I have no interest. I mean, I like to go to my friend's house and party. We'll spend the night there if we have to, but. No more reckless, because I was lucky. A lot of people are not. Mm, I devoured this potato. It's such a delicious taste. Now I'm going to finish my chili bowl. Chili. And then like the chili oil that my wife would use is a chili bowl. Chili bowl. Mm. It's so freaking delicious. It's just. Mmm. Mmm. You guys, if you have not tried this, you should. It is this delicious sisses. I'm gonna kill this right now. I'm about done. Something high in my head because I was just hearing it in the radio. It's hey you. But Liz Zeppelin, oh my god, because I'm going on and on and on. Hey, you. Won't you help me? I don't know what song is in my head. Anyway. Useless information. I could have gotten a soda, but. I don't know why I'm not crazy about soda. I mean, I love Coke and Cherry Coke's my favorite. But every time I drink it, if I drink it every day, I get, I don't know why, I feel guilty. <laughs> Even though every day I'm eating, you know what I'm saying? But I feel guilty, I don't know why. So, I like to have my water. Lay down, we're gonna eat a little bit more because I'm gonna be drinking tonight. 
No, I don't want to get sick. The only way not to get sick is if you have something greasy before you start drinking. So I'm going to have something greasy. Okay. But I feel like this is kind of my health food, even though it's cheesy and potato and all that. It is so freaking good. And yesterday's mussels was delicious. Of course, that corn never made it all night. We ate it. Mm. It's getting down, down, down. It's a good guy. Finito. That was good. I had my chili bowl. I had my potato. And I'm full as full. The later second round later on. We'll be having some more munchies, but that was delicious. Oh my god. Anyway guys, I hope you're having a great weekend. Today's Saturday. Um Hope you know you enjoyed the rest of the weekend. Please be safe. And again, thank you so much for joining me. Again, if you like my video, please give us a thumbs up. And if you don't, please give it a thumbs down. And then um, also, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And again, thank you so much for joining me. Until next time. Peace.